Hello, Venu this side. In this video, I am explaining how to install Jupyter and how to practice Spark, a different, different type of Spark code in your system. I am explaining right now. I think you know how to install all this PySpark, everything in your, uh, uh, in your PyCharm, all these things, that is it. In case if you want to practice same thing, Spark program, everything within the cloud, my recommendation, first, first, where you install Anaconda, in your computer, this is 3.6, I don't recommend, 3.6, 3.8 highly recommendable, okay. In this scenario, first step, uh, if you want to know in the same YouTube description, I am sharing, I am sharing how to install within the Spark, in within the Windows, I am, I already explained, please follow this video, it is available in this YouTube description, okay. Now, first step, you Hello. must install Python 3.8. That's why Conda create n py 3.8 Python is equal to 3.8. Like that, first step, you have to enter like this. If you already installed, then automatically you will get a small warning. If not, enter like this. This is one approach to install Python 3.8, highly recommendable. Here, you are using Python 3.6. It is creating problem. Second one, second one, simple, very, very simple. You must install Python, uh, these drivers. I mean, there is a two important settings you are using. Okay, that is Python driver, PySpark driver, Python related things. I think the entire this code I'm sharing in this YouTube description as well. If possible, please check one more time in this YouTube description. Okay, now Jupyter, how to install? I think just now you install Anaconda. Please check this one. Okay, if you are enter one more time, you will get error. Please check here is Jupyter. Uh, sorry, here already it is installed. Please check like that you will get. Now, first step, go to environment variable. Okay. Go to this environment variable, PySpark.Python. Here you are using 3.6. I don't recommend 3.6. Always use 3.8. Like this, PySpark Py underscore Python followed by this path. Here you have Spark, Anaconda environment, you know. So just to mention like this is one first important step. Next, one more important step, only two steps. Please note, there are many ways. Maybe in my previous videos, I explained different ways, I think. But my recommendation, simple. Click this new uh, PySpark underscore driver, capital letters, case institute, and Python. Here, what happened? My recommendation, small letter, Jupyter. Okay. Just mention Jupyter. That's it. One more thing. It is called same ditto PySpark driver one minute PySpark underscore driver underscore Python okay underscore options here you can use either lab Lab means uh, Jupyter Lab you are you can use. Otherwise, notebook. Small letters. Don't forget small letters. That's it. Congrats. Jupyter, everything configured in your system. You can do anything in your, Jup in your uh, Jupyter right now. Here, only these two settings. Okay. That's it. I recommend this Python environment also. Okay. Python 3.0 only you must use. Otherwise, it's creating new problem. And also don't forget to mention PySpark. I mean, Spark Home. Where the Spark install? If you want to know Spark installation, just to follow that video. I already shared one video in YouTube that is available in this YouTube description also. Okay, now I want to process Jupyter right now. Simple. Open this Anaconda. Uh, already is open, you know, Anaconda. Okay, now, 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 simply use PySpark. No need Jupyter, all these things. Simply enter PySpark. At that time, automatically, it is opening one more tab. Automatically, Google Chrome open. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Wait, wait, wait. The main reason I know what happened if you enter PySpark at what time you install before configure the environment you have. 
That's why if you open PySpark, by default, you will get like this, by default. But just now you modified environment, you know, after modified environment, it is mandatory, close all existing terminal and open new terminal. Earlier you got it one way. Now if you open, maybe not a normal computer, I don't recommend. Please try to open Anaconda. Okay. Anaconda. Now type PySpark. If you type PySpark, automatically it is redirecting to notebook and uh, you will get automatically notebook. Similarly, if you enter PySpark here, what happened? It is opening one notebook. If you want, by default in your local computer, what is the default browser? Maybe in, in your system, it is Firefox. So automatically it is opening. Okay, in that Firefox, click new. Maybe I want to practice. Okay. I want to practice at that time, go to this here, new, here, Python 3. At the time, opening one more new tab. I don't recommend this Firefox. Instead of that, I recommend use Google Colab, Google Chrome. Okay. Uh, just a minute. What happened? It's not opening. Just a minute. Try to open one more, one more time. Or copy this. That is best approach. Okay. Copy this. Open either Google Chrome. Mm. Mm. Okay. I think you will get like this. Next, new. Next, Python. Automatically, you will get like this. Then you can easily practice any Spark program. For example, five minutes back, you are practicing in your local. Okay. Right click. Copy. Now go to this one. Control V. Now just Control Enter. If you enter Control first time you are executing, you know, so it will take a little time, I think. 100% uh, is same. You no need to modify one line also. What are you doing in PyCharm? 100% is same. You can do it in Jupyter. Okay. This is called a cell. Okay. Uh, it is same like a database. Okay. If you want to insert, click this insert and below you can write another program like this. Like a create or replace temp you df dot create or problem is it is not giving any suggestions. Uh, okay. It is giving suggestions. Automatically, it is giving, but here, if you enter tab, automatically give the suggestions. Okay. Tab. Okay. Uh, result is equal to spark.sql. Select star from uh, tab where age is greater than 50. Greater than or equal to 50. At the time, this dot show. Okay. Either control enter, otherwise uh, here run button available above. That's also fine. At the time here, these people you are getting like this. So like this, you can process. 100 percentage, what are you doing in PyCharm? Jupyter also is working fine. This is one approach. Highly recommendable approach. One more approach also available. That is uh, using uh, um, find the spark followed by this one. That is, I will guide you in my next video. Okay, fine. If you have any doubts, Please uh, comment below. I will try my level best to explain. Thank you.